And while it's known for its feisty temperament and bone-crushing bite, it also happens to be one of the most disorganized marsupials. At least when it comes to raising its young. Each mating season, after a chaotic, intense and noisy courtship, the female returns to her burrow to gestate before giving birth to up to 40 pups. Each pup is barely the size of a grain of rice. But survival starts immediately. There are only four teats. Which means the first four pups to latch on will be the only ones to survive. While this might seem like a disorganized approach to family planning, it's actually highly strategic. Unlike herbivorous marsupials, like kangaroos, koalas, and wombats, who typically birth a single joey at a time, Tasmanian devils rely on their high birth rates to ensure only the fittest make it to adulthood. Because being a Tassie devil is tough. Adults live solitary, grueling lives, competing aggressively for food. As one of the few carnivorous marsupials, they primarily hunt and scavenge alone, only coming together at carcasses. where sheer strength and stamina determine who eats and who goes hungry. So, as brutal as it seems, this early life survival test isn't a flaw. It's a necessity. Without this built-in natural selection, the species simply wouldn't endure.